we pick up? We pick up with um, a new character, uh, sorry, a couple of new characters actually. Um, a new werewolf called Kaelin. Um, we pick up with uh, Haley and Hope, and Hope, as you saw in the little teaser that we showed today, um, Hope is now, I think, seven. So we've jumped forward five years. And, you know, we're going to see what Haley and Hope have been up to for the last five years, what they've done to try and get Elijah and Klaus and Rebecca and everyone back. Um, yeah. Hope being seven years old. Yeah. What, what do you think that relationship's going to be like once Klaus gets out of the brick wall? Uh, you know, tumultuous, I would say, probably. It'll be difficult for him. He's going to, you know, uh, I think he spent the last five years, you know, uh, justifying to himself uh, that he did this for his daughter's safety, and now he has to go and look her in the eye and kind of explain that to her and hope she uh, understands and is accepting of the reason why her father's been absent. So he's got some money. I mean, gifts that you think he might bring her? Uh, probably the new iPhone, which as we're five years in, in the future, you know, I'll be curious to see what that looks like. Yeah, uh, y you know, technology in general, probably a hoverboard. I would imagine some of those kind of minority report gloves that she can move things about on her screen yeah. with uh, uh, whatever the latest Pokemon game is, you know. Uh, Something like that, futuristic toys, technology, that kind of thing. Where is Vincent when the season begins? Vincent, when the season begins, is, he holds true to his promise that he made at the end of, um, of season three. Uh, he took back the church from Marcel, remember, and he turned it into a community center where everybody's welcome. Whether you're a vampire, a human, werewolf, witch, it doesn't matter. Anybody who wants to protect New Orleans is, is, is invited into this. So uh, that's where we find ourselves, a new community uh, blooming of all the supernatural com uh, uh, communities. and. And, we're, and that might be upset by uh, some visitors. Yeah, uh, possibly a werewolf named Kylan. Tell us about her. Yeah, um, well, that's a new character. It's played by uh, Christina Moses, as I'm sure everybody knows from uh, Containment. She's a really beautiful actress. Um, so, without giving too much away, werewolves are going to play a, 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 certainly a bigger part uh, in, this, uh, in this season than they, they did last season. Um, and, and Haley is going to meet up with uh, Keelan, and um, let's just say she might play a role in, um, in bringing the Michelsons back. We don't know for sure yet. Where are we going to pick up with everybody? I know you've got one episode under your belt. Yes, um, we, Freya has left enough clues for Haley to hopefully get her out of the dreamscape and give her what she needs to cure her brothers and cure herself and um, just get everyone Make sure everyone's alive, uh, so it's going to be straight back to work for Freya. Um, she has no time for anything else. And then hopefully, if we all get past that, you know, there'll be connection with Hope and maybe a love interest for her and that kind of thing, yeah. Maybe a little revenge, too, uh, against Marcel for what I he think, did? I mean, I think family for her is just absolutely everything. So she will go against anyone who comes against her family. It doesn't matter who it is. Um, she doesn't always want to, but she will. Um, tell us a little bit about, uh, we got a new uh, werewolf called Kylan, is that right? Yes. Okay. Yes. Um, so she's, um, she's going to be, I don't know how much I can tell, um, but she's going to be, she's going to be a strong character in the, in the season and um, Freya's going to have, have a lot to do with her. <laughs> yes.